Welcome to Lifehouse Kids Online. Let's get ready to sing out our praise to Jesus and listen to amazing Bible stories. Today's Bible verse comes from James 4 verse 6. God is against the proud, but He is kind to the humble. So let's pray together. Jesus, my heart is open to you today. Please speak to me. In Jesus' name, Amen. Hi everyone, it's Master Mashed Potato here. So today's story is about people who decided to build this Tall, tall tower. But why did they plan to make this tall tower? And did their plan succeed? Mm, well, why don't we watch the box people together and find out? People had multiplied, and they all lived in the same place, and they all spoke the same language. They made plans to build a great city and a great tower to show how great they all were. They came together and imagined how great they could become. Nothing could stop them from doing anything they wanted. But as they began their megacity that would reach to the heavens, 
their plans did not include the God of the heavens. So God reminded them by confusing their languages. Suddenly, nobody could understand what the other was saying. The confusion was everywhere. Chaos broke out between each person and the great tower came crashing down. They fled the great tower, leaving everything behind. They spread out across the land, looking for a new place to live. But all the plans of people under the sun will never last, because God made us for His purposes. And there is no greater plan than God's plan for our lives. His ways and his thinking are still higher than all our greatest plans and ideas. God is simply the greatest and nobody, no matter who, is greater than God. That's because God is great. Wow, so why did they plan to make this tall tower? They just wanted to show how powerful they were. But they forgot to include God in their plans. Oh no, so because of that, God was not happy with their plan and God gave them different languages to confuse them and their plans ended up failing. So for us, important things to do when making a plan is to always include God and to not to show how powerful we are, but to show how powerful and amazing God is. So let's always remember to put God first and ask for His wisdom. And when we do that, God will help us and gives us the strength to make our plans succeed. So today, why don't we ask God for His wisdom and help? Dear Jesus, thank you so much for giving us incredible plans. I pray for your wisdom within our plans and give us, a, give us the strength to make this happen. In Jesus' name we pray. Everyone said, Amen! So now let's chat with people at home. What kind of wisdom do you want to ask God when making plans? Mm, for me, I like to make a lot of plans so I want to ask for God's wisdom to make sure I'm doing it right. How about you? So for today's activity, let's make a wobbly tower from a milk carton. So ask someone at home to help you cut out the top and the bottom of a milk carton and stick on a colored paper of your choice. Flatten the carton and cut out strips so that you are ready to make your tower. And then you want to carefully stack the pieces up one by one to make your tower. So cut out more cartons to see how tall and wobbly you can make your tower. So let's have fun and try this at home. See you next week. Bye bye. Thank you so much for watching today. We hope that you enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel or follow us on TikTok so that you won't miss any of our amazing content. YouTube channel or follow us on TikTok or follow us on TikTok so that you won't miss any of our amazing content. And we would love to invite you to join us for our Lifehouse Kids Zoom every Sunday. そして毎週日曜日にはライフハウスキッズズームパーティーをやっていてそこにみんなを招待したいよ For more information and to sign up, check the description below. 詳細を知りたい人は下の概要欄をチェックしてね We'll see you in the next video. また次の動画で会おうねバイバーイ